Like if you're trying to unzip the polyurea uh, plastic coating, the, the spalling on the plate, you can shoot like at the edges and the lead bullet will completely like fragment off that steel and splash off the steel underneath the coating. And if you're on the edges enough, it might kind of unzip it for you. And then a few more shots in the middle and you might be able to actually just nicely unzip all that spalling from the from the plate so we'll see how that works hey guys rex here we're going to try the old ruger red hawk this is the old standby here i used to carry this as my everyday carry for a few years actually when i was younger um, and skinnier and could hide it better. Uh, now it's a little too big. It gets in the way with the big guy. We'll try it with my old carry loads, which are the 300 grain Sierra jacketed soft point with, I think, 15.9 grains of Alliant 2400, which, like, always consult your loading manual. Don't take loads from me. Each different combination of components is going to have different pressure dynamics but uh, they are stout i've done penetration tests with those they go through a lot of stuff and so we'll see how it does against the three plus rts tactical steel plates all right this is a rts tactical level three plus give it a try as you can see relatively thin relatively not super heavy <laughs> not a bad deal okay all right first we're going to try for an edge hit before we potentially blow off all the spalling so we're going to try to shoot just on the top edge and see if we can get it to unravel there and then we'll go and shoot at the center Okay, got our eye protection on. We got the T-Rex brand tape. Okay, now we're gonna try to shoot at the bottom edge and uh, we're gonna go on the very bottom below the tape and see how that works. More tape. Okay, now we're going to try to get the last four shots kind of all over on the target without hitting the tape, hopefully, and uh, see if that spalling will come off. deformation on the back of the plate we got no deformation on the back here and 
Got some shots spread out kind of all over here. The spalling does feel like it came loose. It tore off the edge here. A little flappy. Oh, man. Got some lead art. In fact, that's frameable. Very beautiful art. Yeah, we'll frame that. Okay, let's take a look here. We have shot one, shot two, and then there we are. Got a little piece of fragment coming up through the back here, probably a piece of jacket. And did go through the spalling. There's like no visible detent in the steel. Pretty smooth. Yes, sir, she stops bullets like a champ. I guess that'll work.